Welcome to Trivia Viral. Our channel covers all the latest analysis and recaps on TV shows and movies as well as interesting stories and facts that you may not have known. So sit back, relax, and subscribe to our channel if you have been enjoying our videos so far. This story begins with a frantic news broadcast about a young girl who is being taken to the mainland because she won the latest battle royale. That is, a contest in which high school students are pitted against each other in a fatal battle on a remote island. A male Japanese middle school student tries to cope with life after his father's passing by hanging. It seems that only one girl is attending class 3B. Their teacher leaves the class after seeing the sorry state, but a troublemaking student attacks him. The teacher resigns after healing. One year after, class 3B takes a field trip after finishing their semester. However, the bus is filled with sleeping gas. They wake up on a remote island wearing strange electronic collars. The retired teacher explains that their class has been selected to compete in this year's battle royale. The BR Act is a law that passed after 800,000 students walked out of school. An orientation video instructs them to eliminate each other for three days until only one student remains. Students that break the rules or enter a randomly designed death zone will explode by the caller's detonation. This video is sponsored by QD. QD is Asia's largest platform for students, tutors, and coaches to match up for lessons. Sign up at QD today. One of the students whispers to her friends while the video plays. The retired teacher throws a knife at her to teach the class a lesson. When soldiers round up the shock students, the troublemaker questions and challenges the retired teacher for his cruelty, so the teacher cuts him with a knife and also blasts his collar. His best friend watches, completely horrified. The video explains that each student must bring a backpack with food and water and a map. They will also get either one lethal weapon or something that seems worthless to be used for survival, like a saucepan. By using those weapons, they're supposed to eliminate any natural advantage that a student has over the others. In the first six hours of the program, 12 students failed, with four of them taking their own lives. Two exchange students become the most noteworthy players in the game. One of them seems dangerous, and the other one is merciful. One of the students is a basketball player, and he plans to hack into the computer system with some of his friends to disrupt it. Another female student seems cutthroat, taking out other students with ease. One boy promises to keep another girl safe for the late troublemaker who was his best friend. The troublemaker was in love with her but never told her. Meanwhile, a girl in a yellow tracksuit runs into a sleazy male student who is obsessed with her. When he tries to force himself on her, she takes him out. Eventually, she's taken out by the cutthroat girl. The nice exchange student teams up with the boy and the girl and reveals that he won a previous battle royale. Though at the cost of his girlfriend, he now sullenly vows to get revenge. Then, when the dangerous exchange student strikes them, the three are forced to split. The boy wakes up and is bandaged by a cheerleader in a lighthouse. The cheerleader helps him get his bearings after being out for nearly a whole day. Five other girls who are part of the school's cheerleading squad have been guarding the lighthouse and hiding there ever since the beginning of the program. The girls gather at the dining table to weigh in on possible ways to escape from the island. One girl is sure that the boy ended the life of a friend of hers, so she tries to poison the boy's food. But one of her friends accidentally eats it. As a result, she passes. This causes a massive, fear-fueled gunfight, which ends with all the girls passing, except for the one who poisoned the food. She is plagued with guilt, so she jumps off the deck of the lighthouse. So, the boy returns to the girl and the nice exchange student, and they set off to find the group that is disabling the callers. The cutthroat student takes out two students who are into each other. The dangerous exchange student is watching from the rafters and shoots down the cutthroat student right after. All the seven students who are still alive prepared to sabotage the rules of the game the hackers managed to penetrate the military computer system. Then they prepared to destroy it with a truck converted to be a firebomb. Then at the last second they are discovered by the dangerous exchange student. Though the team gets eliminated, one of them manages to detonate the truck and severely injure the exchange student. When the trio arrives at the hacker's base, they eventually beat the dangerous exchange student in a gunfight. The nice exchange student is aware of the caller's internal microphones. On the morning of the last day, he takes his friends aside and fakes their elimination. The teacher suspects that the winner has manipulated the system, so he ends the game and dismisses the troops, intent on eliminating the winner himself. The teacher realizes that the exchange student had hacked into the game's internet system months ago, and that this has disabled both the girl and the boy's tracking devices. He unveils a picture that he made of the lifeless students, with the girl named as the winner. He confesses that he always considered the girl to be his daughter, in replacement of his biological one who hated him. He is shot by the boy after threatening the two at gunpoint. The three survivors leave on a boat, but the exchange student is left injured from his gunfight. He is happy he found true friends. Two of the survivors have been declared fugitives and are last seen on the road. What are your thoughts about the story? Let us know in the comments section below.
Subscribe if you would like to see more similar videos, and give us a thumbs up to get more recommendations of our videos. Be the first to watch the latest videos by clicking the bell icon. See you on the next video.